Hey, what's going on out there? How are you doing? I hope you're doing well. I am a Johnny come lately to the beatbox scene. I got a lot of videos on beatbox, but I'm still Johnny come lately. I still am not necessarily sure what it is I'm hearing or what I'm enjoying, but hey, you don't have to hey, you don't have to know specific things in order to enjoy it. So I do enjoy D'Lo, and I hope that his uh, wild card is a is this a wild no the seating round. I'm just saying wild card. But uh, man, when is D'Lo not good? You know what I mean? See, that's funny. Six months ago, I wouldn't have said that. I would be like, "Who's D'Lo?" So things change. No, I ain't gonna say anything. We're gonna turn this video on. That's what we're gonna do. And we're gonna have what I hope is an amazing, awesome time in 2021. It's like the first month of the new year. Come on, let's do it. Uh -huh. Welcome to D Lo's seating round of the SBX Kickback Battle 2021. With three minutes on the clock, I say the three, and I say the two and the one. In three, two, one, beatbox. Hello, I'm D-Lo, and I hope you enjoy my set. Whoa, got your back one, boy, you close to me. Whoa, got your back one, boy, you close to me. Whoa, got your back one, boy, you close to me. I'ma cut your claims away, can chop away your energy. Whoa, got your back one, boy, you close to me. Whoa, got your back one, boy, you close to me. I'ma cut your confidence and chop away your energy. Hey! It was already a good move. I'm already happier. I know this is supposed to be about D'Lo, but I'm a very selfish, arrogant person, and I just want to be happy, and I'm already happier listening to him do this. So, thanks, man. Thanks, D'Lo. Your energy. Oh, those little clicks. I should know those clicks by now, but I don't. Those little clicks he's doing. Absolutely. I just wanted to just pause. Confidence and chop away your enna 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 enemies. I'ma chop your dreams away and leave you with the enemies. Hold on. Uh, I've been fucking around more in Ableton and production and stuff, and what is kind of tripping me out is that his drum sounds are better than a lot of the samples that are in the fucking program. His snare, his mouth snare is better than a lot of the actual snares in the program. He, he's not a drum, he's a person. And his snare is better. And now for the next number, Wild Bell, featuring Snake Hips and D-Lo. <coughs> you say that you want me is to lay. It's too late to love. You say that you need Go ahead, me man. It's too late. How do you do the water? I do the water with the, I hit my face. How do you do the water without hitting your mouth? Mm-mm. 
Yeah, dude. I just like it. Yeah, I don't know. You know, this this channel has gone through so many different revisions. Like maybe I'm supposed to say something technical, and I'm not. Okay, I will. I'll say I'll try to do something technical. Not real technical. Just clarity. Clarity, precision. It's not what he's doing. It is what he's doing, but it's that he does it with clarity and precision. He's on time every time. He has a nice feel about what he's doing. He doesn't feel like he's stressed out. He feels like this is very comfortable for him to do this, which makes me comfortable to watch him do it. Yeah. A lot of people are good at shit. But they're like so stressed out trying to be good that you get stressed out watching them and then you don't even want to watch because you're like nervous. You're like, I hope they don't fail because they seem so stressed out. Like, what are they going to do? He just seems like, bro, I, I got this shit like so in the pocket. I'm ready. I felt like he could do this as many times in a row as you want him to do it. Like, wake him up in the morning. Just throw water on his face. Hey, D-Lo, play me that fucking seat and round shit. And he'd be like, okay. And then just nail it. And it makes me happy. It makes me happy. And this reaction is toast. Toast. Wait, why did I say toast? I said it. It's toast. <laughs> 